Hello guys, welcome back to part three of Madison. Sorry, it's been a while. I've had a spell of being lazy, as you do. I went to Wales, I came back, and for a week I was lazy, so yeah. But now we're here, playing the game. So, without further ado, let's dive right in. We last, we're 55% of the way through as well, guys, which means we're halfway through halfway anyway so we are we've just done the bit where we've gone back in time and been chased by a man in a gas mask that was terrifying um and now we're going on to solve more even more puzzles and clues and get the hell out of this place huh how's about that i um i'm also sweating as well it's red hot at the minute it's like 32 degrees and i've shut my curtains well my blind my windows, my door, so now this room is producing heat because of my lights and my computer. So we're producing a lot of heat right now and I'm sweltering. And also, I've put these eyelashes on my eyes and the glue's really sticky and my eyelids keep sticking to the top. So if my eye goes a bit funny halfway through this, you know why. Anywho, let's carry on, shall we? So yeah, we've just come back into the attic. Uh, from that place there. Uh, we are not going back, okay? We've done that, we've done it. I still need to find something to, um, okay, yeah, I still need to find stuff to use. I don't know what's gonna happen now, I don't know where we need to go, I can't remember the, oh, come on, how do it still keep sticking together, oh my god. That creaking really pisses me off, so we'll go downstairs. Something's bound to happen if we go back downstairs, surely. Let's go back down. Yep. Telefonica? Ringing? Oh my god, it was the fan. <laughs> I thought someone was stood there. Oh, I nearly died. I've tried to call you. Priest Thomas speaking. I was able to finally get the information you asked for, and the truth is... The truth is, I'm worried about your family. Generally speaking, demons try to complete simple rituals to break the bondage of their souls. To carry out this ritual, you must rid yourself of an object with important sentimental value to you. Offer it as a sacrifice. There were practitioners of witchcraft who became haunted as a result of their thievery and dishonesty. They used to steal jewellery from ancient dynasties as to avoid performing the sacrifice directly for themselves with their own sentimental objects. They bought the sacrifice with the emotions of others. But, but this perverse being is trying to go beyond even that. We are speaking of an ancient ritual of which very little is known. Seven sacrifices, seven mutilations. Seven I believe we are facing a, a, a body exchange type of ritual. Madison Hale was trying to complete such a ritual before she was murdered, and now she is forcing your child to finish it for her. She is trying to steal your son's body. body Call me ritual. as soon as you get this message. Is that what she's after? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Grandpa never got over her death. That's Grandma. That's Grandma. Right. Oh, look at you. How do I use my camera? Like that. Getting to know you, getting to know all about you. Why are all the cockroaches going this way? There's loads of them. Oh, look here. I think there's something else under that plank. Can I 
can use something for this? Do I have anything? Okay. Right, okay. Oh, what was that key anyway? Sorry. Uh, tab. Oh, right, okay. Basement key. Cool. Right, I think we're going to the basement then. I love going to the basement. Basement is my friend. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Basement. Basement. Haven't we already been in the basement? I want to go back to the basement. This is the right key, right? Ah, yes, okay. Oh, we took a picture of it and that's how we got into it last time, wasn't it? Yeah, because it was definitely... This was definitely not in the thing. Okay, what's this? The crowbar is in the basement. What the hell is this place? What the fuck? What the fuck? This place, this place gives me what the fuck. <sighs> Are you kidding me? Oh wait, do I have to do something with this? What do I have to? Oh god! Ah! the shovel. Luca. Fuck off lady. Can I store some things? I might need that. I don't think I need that. Lady please you are creeping me the fuck out. Luca. Luca. I just need to find this freaking crowbar and I have no idea what I'm doing. goes back. <laughs> Stop it! Oh god. Guys. I don't even go into the dark, you know. <gasps> there it is.
god, I feel like they're getting closer. Whoa. from these silly tears excuse me okay so she keeps stop it she keeps moving right I'm gonna use crowbar up here first because I know there's something up here that I need to get and then I'll go into the other room. I do hate being in this room though. If you find this, do not listen. Well, I'm listening to it. You can't tell me not to do it and then not expect me to do it. To not do it. I'm gonna find out what's going on. I got an achievement, so you shouldn't have listened. My mind. Grandma? I cannot trust anyone. Not even Albert. If you are listening to this, Blue Knees is real. Blue Knees? Who's Blue Knees? I know I'm not sick. And I know I don't have much time left. The fucking thing. Right behind me, singing that fucking song over and over and over and over and over in my head. Oh, Boonies is behind and will find what he's been looking for God. for so long. All I alone, she was sick. where he belongs. Mm. Oh. Do this. This ah. is behind, ah. and we'll find ah. what he has been looking for. Oh, the kitchen, where he's written this song, just for you. over the kitchen just for you. Oh, and also we need something to break the chains as well. I don't know if a crowbar will, no. Will you do that? She's gone, look. She's gone again. This thing freaking me out, following me everywhere. Right, okay. So we listened to the do not listen tape and found his grandma. Hmm. she mentioned in her diary. But why would I need a ring? <laughs> God. My, my eyes. My eyes burn. God. God. I, 
I need to get out of this fucking house. I can't work out what that is. I don't like remember a... drawing any of these. Am I? Like an eye. Insane. A, a eye or a mouth. I I think. Is it? Oh no! Wait! Oh no! Wait! That's a chair. Do you know? At first glance, it just looks like a weird eye. Do you know what I mean? Can you see? Can you see where I'm coming from, though? I'm not very good at them drawing things, but you know, you, you look at things and you guess the drawing or what you see first or whatever. I'm just not. I'm not. I don't see what you're supposed to see. Yeah. Where, where did these come from? Oh, I found the key. What's this? Body exchange. A body ritual. exchange ritual. I. I need to put an end to this. A sentimental object. The ring. Seven sacrifices. I don't know. Oh, you cut in the body into seven. Two bodies, a guest, and a host. Human ashes. I've basically got everything I need for this sacrifice and haven't I? They've just basically made me get everything I need for the sacrifices. I've got the bodies. I'm guessing this is what these things are for. I've got the ring. Uh, she killed somebody. I've got her fucking head. I don't have ashes though. Shit the bed guys so I do I need to put them in here then right so I I'm finishing yeah I'm finishing this ritual look right okay why am I doing this Do I have everything? Do I... What's in them containers? Shall I try those containers? That I stored? Because that's got the pictures, right? It's got the pictures of the bodies. And maybe that other thing's got the ashes, I can't remember. I can't remember, but there seems to be only two more things I've been collecting all this time. Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I think I should open it first. Okay, yeah. How do I open this? How do I how do I open it though? I, I think I should open it first. But how? How does one open this box? Something. I've got that other key now though to unlock that door at the end. So maybe there's something in there that we need to finish off this ritual. Oh, that did both. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Right, let's open the door. What's in here then? This house is huge. This has got to be the front door, though, no? It's got to be. Oh, a picture. What is this? This is from Grandma's diary. It's 
to read. June 15th, 1972. I hate when Albert spends the night working. Once it gets dark, it it's like the world turns upside down. There are creaking noises all over the house. And the house. I know my sight is getting worse, but yesterday I lost in my own home. I got lost in my own home. And it's not because of my sight. The rooms are moving around. I couldn't even find my own bedroom. We are not safe in here. Not anymore. Not with this thing living among us. June 16th, 1972, so the day after. Albert got mad at me for lighting candles up all over the house, but for some reason, I think light protects us. It probably does, you know. Anything else around here? Right, okay, down these creepy stairs we go. There must be something useful here. Those. What do I need that for? That. I definitely need that. These must be Madison's victims. Or maybe the other one was Ashes? Can I turn this off? Do we stay on now? Someone stopped the tunnel. Right, okay. I have what you need. attached to one of us, it's all but impossible to stop. 
They play with our bodies and minds. Does this mean that until they find what they were yeah, looking for? Is attached to the no camera? Probably, human. yeah. Attached they are to me? Beyond everything we know. Sean, I implore <laughs> She's you. She's no longer human. Seek she... help. I'll investigate that woman you told me about. Um, Madison Hale. And I'll get back to you as soon as I find something. Keep all of this information away from your son. Get rid of that camera as soon as you get this message, but please, please do be careful. If your child has already had contact with this entity, his life, yours, and your family's are in Mom. jeopardy. Chanel, what have I done? Uh oh, I think. I need to find a way to end this. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it burns. Uh, <laughs> is My body burns. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Hor horns? <laughs> horns? Horns? What do you mean, horns? I think I've seen something like this in the house. Huh. Is that it? Horns. We've seen horns, have we? Do not use. Well, we use it. What is this? How many times do I have to tell you there's nobody in this house? Al? I'm done with your bullshit. Albert, listen to me. Just a book. A fucking book, Elizabeth. See? There's no one here. It doesn't exist. It's not real, goddammit. I know. Everything that's happening to me has something to do with it. I just know it's... It's a disease, Elizabeth. You are sick, for the Lord's sake. I'm not sick. You'll end up losing your mind if you don't cut the crap. That book has nothing to do with your illness. I wish you stopped acting like a child. Stop hiding our stuff and take your goddamn pills. Do Jesus! Do, do you think it's normal? Do you think pupils vanish like dust? I'm telling you that that, that fucking thing is what's causing Enough, it for me. Enough, Elizabeth. Stop acting like a ten-year-old and go to bed. Albert. Oh, dear. Everything started the day we brought that fucking book to this house. It's a disease, Elizabeth. Don't believe me. I will leave this place. I'm done. And I'm taking Johnny with me. We are not staying hey, hey, here. Hey, wait a minute. This is... This is way too much. You're paranoid, Ellie. It's 4 a.m., Elizabeth. Just go back to bed before we wake up Johnny. Come on. We can talk about this. You're going to regret this. You'll end up all alone! Just you and your stupid fucking clock! Oh. Okay. Occupied! Sorry!
find horns. Freaking horns! Yup. Yup. Four. No, no, no. Oh, it's gonna make no. me take pictures of things. No, not right? again. No. Fuck. I, I can't feel my fingers. What is happening to my body? No, oh, maybe not. Oh, no, yep, 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 yep. Uh, Wait. I, I don't know what this could mean. Wait. There was a red light, but everything was dark. The doorbell. I, I gotta get to the front door. There is no fucking escape. Sources, the 43-year-old woman, Madison Hale, intended on murdering seven people. Fortunately, the police were notified before she could carry it out, putting an end to the massacre after the fourth victim. It is still unknown if she was under the influence of any drugs, or if it was actually a witchcraft ritual as indicated. Madison hit his head 
contact with a sharp object repeatedly. I can the press young X. man died instantly. His body was dismembered as well. The second victim was her 71-year-old mother. According to police reports, Madison amputated both of her legs while she was still alive. The woman passed away due to great loss of blood. Hours later, Madison continued to mutilate her body before disposing of it. Nice. The second victim was her 71-year-old uh, mother. I don't According to police nice. reports, Madison amputated both of her legs while she was still alive. Mutilated his body in such a way that his face was unrecognizable. His body was found in pieces inside the well along with the other corpses. So far, his left leg and three fingers have not been found. I wonder what these numbers are for. The first victim was her own 75-year-old father. Madison mutilated his body in such a way that his face was unrecognizable. His body was found in pieces inside the well along with the other corpses. So far, his left leg and three fingers have not been found. Four, three, the first victim was her own 75-year-old father. Madison mutilated his body in such a way that his face was unrecognizable. His body was found in pieces inside the well along with the other <laughs> numbers on this one. Confused. You, 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 okay, I don't, I don't get it. I officially don't get it. Okay, so I had to have a quick look because I am so stuck. Um, I think you have to put them in order. From what it looks like, not I think. From what I've seen, so we did the first one. Her 71-year-old mother. According to police.
police reports, Madison amputated both of her legs while she was still alive. The woman passed away due to great loss of blood. Hours later, Madison continued to mutilate her body before disposing of it. The second victim was her 71-year-old mother. According to police reports, Madison amputated both of her legs while she was still alive.
why it's so I needed a file for that. I thought I needed a tile and I needed to open them up. My body, my hands, 
And this is what the priest was talking about. That thing is... That thing is feeding off of me. What the fuck does this even mean? The house is full of clocks. to work in here. This is the combination to one of the saves. It might be the green one because it's got green rims around it with the thingy. So I'm gonna go with green safe. And that is nine left. Eleven something. And then something. Maybe that is on the other notebook, maybe? Could this be the same one? The combination again. Eleven right. And then eight left. need the combination you know where to find it and the combination is highlighted so drew a clock to a through it to off, uh, throw us off so we're gonna go one two three four five six set seven eight nine one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. <laughs> so clever. Okay, let's read this. John, my son, I'm an old man already and life has passed to all of us. I'm so proud to see the man you've become. I'm so happy to have deeply enjoyed the two grandchildren that you gave me, Luca and Chanel. I write this letter so that one day you can understand everything that's going on through my mind right now and debunk the myth that I'm a crazy old man. God does exist, and just like him does Satan. All my life I tried not I tried hard not to believe, but time has shown me I was profoundly mistaken. Your mother was not sick at all, and I couldn't prevent her sad ending from happening. As far fetched as it sounds, Blue Knees is real. Not a single specialist was able to trace down the cause of her condition, not to mention find a treatment to help her fight. I truly wish I could go back in time and tell her I believe you. I kept trying to contact her for over 15 years. I just wanted to speak with her just one last time. Soon we'll meet again and I'll beg her for to forgive me. This loneliness reminds me day after day how hard it is to live without my most precious and beloved person in the world. At least I can see her face in every room of this huge house. Regarding the book, I tried to burn it, tear it, bury it, but there's no use bothering. It somehow manages to get back. Anyway, I now keep it in my possession under locks and keys. I will not allow history to repeat itself. Thank you for being the son I've always dreamt to have. Love your dad. Albert Maxwell. Oh, that's quite sad actually. We've got a clock face now though. I wonder if this will work for this one then. Should we try it? I, I, I don't think it will, but we, we could try it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two. Oh, I did it wrong anyway.
So that's the time, 12.25. So I take one of those out and it gives me the other one. So I put one of those in and it gives me the other one. Well, that's the 12.25 clock, isn't it, TikTok? So... Where do, where, where do I put it? I've got the... I've got the one I need. Basically. I've got the one I need. That's the one I need. 12.25. But where... Which... Do I put it? Right, anyway, guys, I'm gonna leave it here for today because I've been playing for an hour and 40 minutes, just mainly because I've been running around and so I don't to do anything. Also, it's been long enough and I've got to edit and I'm really, really hot and I, can't, I cannot physically carry on playing anymore because I will die. Um, I'm sweating because I'm scared and I'm also sweating because I'm baking and I need to open a window. The reason I don't open a window is because the bedroom that I use is on the front and I don't want the outside world hearing me scream. Okay? They don't deserve that. They don't They don't need to know what's going on in this house. Right? I'm really enjoying this game. This game is really, really good. It's, it's just... Phew. They've done good. These guys have done good. These developers have done really, really well. This is so good. Next time, I'm, uh, I'm hoping we will finish. If you liked today's video, guys, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, why not? Why? What is stopping you? If you're watching my videos, just subscribe, yeah? If you don't want, if you don't like them, then obviously don't. But if you've watched it right till the end, till now, then subscribe, hit it. Just hit that button. It's like in the, which way am I looking? It's in this corner, somewhere. I, I have a little watermark, you know? You can just click it. <laughs> Join me in the next video for part four, and I'll be seeing you very shortly.